Well hello everybody and welcome to an episode of H1Z1 Today uh, ladies, gents, boys and girlies we are actually on the test server um, I've, I have actually done a little uh, a little work on the test server just to get us started I've made a, a uh, basic shack, barbecue and a finis and a duplicator Yes we have um, Really, all I'm going to use this for is just to see what we're able to do in here, and we're not able to do in the uh, in 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 the real game on the other servers. First of all, um, I'm having difficulty um, throwing grenades or the flashbangs. I do have a couple already in my uh, my secret stash, but I've just tried them and they didn't work. So what I'm going to do is we're going to go and have a run down to the um, into the dam, and we'll check. Because you would have thought, being as this is a test server, I now don't quote me on this, but I I'm led to believe that the test server they put all these sort of like updates on here first before ish, um, putting them into the uh, into the real game. Um, that's my thoughts anyway so if if that is the case there shouldn't be any reason why I shouldn't be able to uh, throw a grenade actually did I put those grenades away I did well I'll leave it to, yeah we've got a couple of bits and pieces so we're going in here and we'll check out the dam to see if we can find some grenades we're not going to need the axe in here quite civilized in here we are now there are a couple of chests or lockers and just up here and there's one there oh we'll have a we'll have a shotgun and a couple of rounds thank you got my pipes it's not pipes we need it's grenades or flashbangs, we don't want the handcuffs. And there's a military backpack, we don't need that either at the moment. We'll take the saline though, that, that might always come in uh, handy. Another backpack that's good, I think. You know, you know quite a few backpacks are uh, in the game, but the only places obviously you could find. The military one is in, uh, you know, a place like this, the police station or the fire station. You know, they're not just thrown um, in, oh, there you go. They're not just thrown in, like, houses, you know, in drawers or wardrobes and things. Oh, and there's another one. Look. No, right, so we got a, we got ourselves a, oh, this is a stun grenade. I'm sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is a stun grenade. Uh, the flashbang, the flashbang grenade. But we'll uh, we'll look for a grenade as well. Because you never know, they may have fixed it. Fingers crossed. It might be just those ones that I have. They're a bit they're a bit buggy. Because um, I'm t uh, today. I think there was a bit of a uh, a bit of an update on this server I've not read into what has been uh, fixed or implemented let's have a look up here somebody's already been up here by the looks of things oh there you go so we've got two there so what I'm going to do so I'm just going to stand I'll tell you what we'll go outside because it might not let you uh, throw the grenades inside the uh, inside the dam so uh, let's go outside and have a look ta -da! outside oh that's a new one because um, what do you call it zombies have not actually been spawning on the dam take him down anyway 
so he's not pestering us. Now if you look at this the zombie, oh he's just disappeared. There you go, didn't take long to rot away did he? Right now let's go into, ta press our tab button. Uh, now I'm going to have to drop something here, so we'll drop the bow for a second. We'll try this grenade first. Now I'm sure it's right click and throw, so it's still not working. I'm sure I'm doing it the right way. Take it out. Put the flashbang in. Let's press her. Do it this way. All right, right click. I think to aim or throw. And left click to let it go. But nothing is happening. Now I could press E. That's not doing anything. I'll press F. G. T would obviously take me back to. Uh, tab cap lock nothing control alt no nothing so obviously the grenade and the flashbang for me anyway is still um still faulty fucking bag of shit <coughs> going to punch like an idiot now there you go. But if anybody can let help me out with that, you know, whether it's me, you know, I'm trying to um, throw it with the wrong keys. Could you let us know? Because that is a pain in the ass. So anyway, uh, let's let's see what else it was there. Now let's have a look at the gun. See now, look with the gun. As you know, to aim, you would uh, right click and then left click obviously to fire. Or you can just left click to fire anyway. Um, so I don't know, I'm at a loss, to be honest. Uh, the game's not doing it for me at the moment. It's, you know, that's been, what, a week? Uh, that the uh, grenades, or, or maybe two weeks, is it? The grenades have been out, and I've only been able to throw, I think, one. But that was off camera. Now, I could go in to verify the game files yet again, but it's not working on this server, the test server, and it's also not working on, you know, our our multiplayer server. So, I don't know. I am totally fuckled we'll just take the ammo for now now, I was on here the other day and uh, there was a couple of nice American girls um, helping me out and I was helping them out there's a crowbar in there might come in handy at some, some point nothing in there so I think is what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it here for today because, like I say, it was just to see what the the grenades um, were going to give us, and it's not give us anything. Oh, old bunny, dead bunny. Die then. I want your meat. That's. No, that's. Oh, there you go. We have a bunny. We have food. Are you going to give me a bloody meat or what? Obviously not. So I think things are still a little bit messed up on this game. Now the other day, oh yeah, the other day we were having trouble dropping things, weren't we? But as you could see, we could drop, yeah, we can drop that. Yeah, we can drop that. So the, as far as dropping things, that's obviously okay now. Uh, let's go and put those bags of shit grenades in here. So I don't think I'll be uh, doing much more to this video unless, um, you know, the grenades and what have you. Maybe it might have something to do with PV, PVE, you know, because we're on a PVE server. 
might have something to do with that, but surely uh, you could still throw the grenade and not kill players. Let's close that door. Um, yeah, you know, that, that would make sense, I suppose, being on a PvP, uh, PvE play, uh, server and the grenades probably do kill um, other players. Well, we don't want that. I mean, this is a, a happy community. <laughs> um, so I might actually try going on a PvP and see if it works or just talk to somebody that plays it and let uh, Actually, no, that's wrong. Because the other day we were on uh, our normal server, the, uh, the No Hope PvE server, and uh, my American friend um, Axe, he came on and he had a grenade and a flash grenade and he was able to throw it. So it might just be down to to the player. I'm not sure. I just don't know anymore. But like I said, if anybody could help us out, please do so. Because it is being a bit of a pain. It's one of the things I've been looking forward to in the game, having a grenade or something, you know, other than water pistols and an axe. Um, yeah, yeah, it would be nice. Let's just check this place out down here. See if there's any more ammo. There's a bit more ammo down here. Always oh, a couple of sheets as well. We'll pick the sheets up. Leave the pipes. I don't really plan on doing a great deal of building on on this server because everything that we're building is going to be on the other server. Uh, which I think I might jump on to a rider now. So if you can just give me a moment, that's what I'm going to do, is I'm going to try something clever here. I'm going to uh, jump out of this game and see if I can just jump straight into my other one. So bear with me, I will be back. Bye bye on this server, for the now. Hello, welcome back. Here we are now over on the uh, No Hope uh, PVE server. As you can see uh, from the last video, of, we've got a car. We have a car. And we have walls all the way around. And we have a gate. Yes, indeed. Um, and I've also put a couple of uh, shacks along this side to see if there's a way that we can actually get over to the other base but at the moment it's proving to be a bit of a shit because all we all we can do at the moment is run and drop <laughs> uh, and not jump so yeah that's that's the only way we can get across at the moment is uh run and jump across uh is what i could really have done with um i've tried now yesterday with the Demi uh, demolition hammer trying to get rid of these that wall there and that wall there so then I was hoping to try and get a uh, shack that goes from that side over to this side yeah but it's not having it uh, the, the demolition hammer is not working for some reason I don't know why oh we have a we have a guest or a visitor there you go we work that time He's obviously da going off down to uh, Pleasant Valley. Let's have a quick look. I could see him, but I couldn't hear him. Still not. No, it's gone. I can hear the bees. But yeah, I th he was heading that way. And also, I've put a uh, a foundation inside that one. I'm not going to jump across yet because it will mean you know, jumping over and, and what have you. But uh, but I've lined it up. Whoops! If we walk along the wall here, very nimble we are. Uh, that way. Now, if you have a look down this the edge of this wall here, that's pretty damn straight. Not a hundred percent. But is what I'm going to be doing on this is there's going to be double walls. So there's going to be a double wall here on the you know like we've done on this one. But also we're going to um, 
put uh, shacks and uh, what have you in there but we're going to put a wall around that as well but the only way into that side would obviously be from here because this is where the doors are one door there and a gate there so yes hopefully it's going to work because i've lined them up fairly decently but other than that the only other thing i might be able to try is to perhaps take away that staircase take away that wall there but but mind saying that the uh well, the deck's there now so that's going to be a bit of a no-no or just try maybe knock one of these walls out because i've got enough um metal sheets to uh to make more shacks and what have you so i could perhaps try putting a uh, a shack there and see if it go across i'm not i don't know i just don't know this building thing is not all it's cracked up to be <laughs> uh but we shall see we'll we'll, we'll pass, play around with that uh as and when uh i have uh been on uh off camera out well obviously as you can see because i've gathered quite a bit of stuff um i've got killed yes i got killed by a bloody bear nearly got killed again yesterday by a bear it was hiding behind a car and i didn't see it and all of a sudden all it coming ladies greasy paws on me and killed me off i didn't have a great deal on me to get uh, to lose so i didn't even bother going back looking for it um but then my friend flynn we uh we were on team speak and he said oh you know basically get your ass down here to the police station so we went to the police station well i, I went to the police station to meet up with him and there was this fella trying to get into the uh you know the basement but uh, we set up a little trap anyway, you know, basically just, just to stop, just to see if we could stop people from getting in there, to see if there was a way. And we, we found it, but this fella obviously thought that he'd, uh, he'd found a way to crack it. So he just sat on this bloody barrel. He put a barrel in front of the door and he sat there and sat there and sat there and sat there and sat there. And, sat there. and uh, you know, I asked him quite politely, could you effing move? But he wouldn't. Uh, but to cut a very long story short a zombie spawned inside the police station now my friend Mr Flynn he managed to get out and we locked ourselves in a room so the zombie couldn't get us but this player he was just sat there sat there and sat there again letting this zombie chew on him anyway he chewed on him that much and killed him but you know what happens if you die you leave your um your, your all your belongings in a bag so you might be able to go back and get it or people like us ransack the bag and take all the belongings yeah and that's what we did obviously we didn't want to see it all go to waste and as you can see on my player i've got the 2000 uh bulk uh backpack thanks to that chap so now i'm able to carry a lot more stuff and i've also got a, a helmet the skin is what my uh, my friend Mr. Flynn um, he brought one of these uh, wearable uh, uh, crates, uh, and that's the uh, the helmet sc uh, skin. So yeah, we're wearing the same at the moment. But yeah, so you know if if you ever in that predicament, you know, and there's a trap, don't try try getting in there. Just wait. Somebody's going to crack it let it not be you because like i said you know the zombies will get you eventually like it did yesterday i just wish i was able to record it i should have done but you know being um uh, the time of day you know uh, the kids were home we had a lot of background noise so uh so i wasn't able to record but anyway the police car is doing quite fine just sat there I'm not going to be hoarding cars, you know. We've got one. That, that's all we ever. That's all we're going to, ever going to need. As long as it stays in good health, you know. We've got we've got batteries, we've got plugs, and we've got biofuel. So yeah, one is enough. But we need a couple of players on at a time so we can go 
uh, looting, you know, get more scrap. So anyway, let's go back to this. If you can come up with some sort of ideas for me, because I am damn right stuck. Is what I really wanted, like, because you can't get these, um, uh, you know, the old Tampa grounds. I couldn't really get it any closer than that. Um, because if I could, I would have had no trouble at all. But because it's there's there's a bit of a gap. Uh, it means I'm unable just to walk straight across. Now I've tried putting uh, animal traps across. That didn't work. Um, storage containers. That didn't work. I even tried one of those little wooden shacks, the basic shacks, to see if that would fit. It would fit, but it wouldn't go green. Um, what else have I tried? I'll tell you what I haven't tried is a workbench. Yeah, workbench. Let me see. I think I might have one of those handy or going uh, spare inside my secret stash. Okay, why is nothing highlighting in my secret stash? There it is. Taking a while. And I think they're towards the bottom. There's one. So let's take that. See if I can place that up there anyway. Or let's close the door. Because you don't know, while we've been away, somebody may have found a way to get in here. Um, now, oh, actually, I wonder if... Can you place... No, I don't think you can. Because what would have been handy is if you could place something on top of... Oh no, it won't even go up here. Look, it go there. But as soon as the legs leave the edge of the, the property, it goes again. Shit. So that's a... That's a no-no as well. Yeah, you can place it there. Can't place it anywhere down there. Hmm. Uh, so what else could we do? What would be good is if they could implement like floors. You know, like um, uh, wooden floors. Like, you know, because they've done a door there now. You know, as well as a gate. They've done a door, so surely you know it wouldn't take a lot to be able to build your own little shack. Um, rather than one of these that take quite a lot of resources, you know, these big fellas, is to implement walls, ceilings, and maybe floors. So you could actually build your own designs, you know, so, you know, you could walk from room to room to room to room, yeah? Rather than just having, you know, a bog standard um, shack like these, where all you can do, what all, all you can do is this. So you can't even place a workbench on the floor in here. See, now this would be an ideal place to have a workbench inside your shack, where all your secret stuff is. But you can place it out here. So I think it could be something like the uh, the secret stash, as I uh, I probably told you in uh, one of my latest uh, videos. With the secret stash, if you put that down, like I've done in, uh, in here. Let's get rid of this workbench. Like I did in here, you see, uh, I had trouble uh, placing a secret stash and then putting the, uh, the shack on top. Uh, you know, the basic shack. So anyway, I placed that and I thought, oh shit, that's, that's it. That's me buggered. But anyway, as it happened, it wasn't because then I built this bad boy. And it went straight over the top of the secret stash. So there you go. So put your stash down first. And then come and build yourself one of these bad boys. And your stash will be inside. But you probably won't be able to add any more. Unless you, you know, you put them down first. So you could probably put another three or four down there. Um, and just leave them. And then put this, put this fella on top. Bob's your uncle. So there you go. Um... So I'm not going to be doing a great deal more on, on here for today because, uh, you know, I've shown you that the grenades don't actually work on the test server. Uh, let me have a quick look on here. I've got one grenade, one flashbang, and we're going to check now to see whether they work on here, which I very much doubt. 
so let's uh, let's try. Uh, but, but oh, we've got all, already got one in the hand. I'm not going to throw it inside my base because I don't want to blow up my car. So let's try up here. Let's go into. There you go. It won't even let me aim. No, it let me do that like I'm swinging a, a what do you call it, a, a crowbar, but it's still not letting me throw it. So let's press tabs so once. Try again. Now let's go uh, crouch. Grenade. Throw. No, see it's still not letting me do it. So again, it's not just a test server that it's not allowing me to throw them, it's this one as well. So if this one's like that, the the old fla the old flashbang will probably be exactly the same. There you go, aim it anywhere you like, throw it. Keep your finger on the button and then throw it. No, see it's not working. So there you go. That's top and tail of today's episode. The grenades are crap. They're not working. So please, please, please do the developers. Get them sorted. Because if you don't, I'm going to call it a day on here. <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> uh, they'll get around to fixing it. Uh, just me being daft. So we're, we're still not able to throw. Right, so let's, let's get rid of that bad boy. Just in case it goes off in my hand. Alright, that's gone. So anyway, ladies and gents, boys and girlies, I'm going to leave it there for today. I know we we, we haven't done any sort of like building, but uh, stay tuned because we are. We, we will eventually sort of like fill, fill all these up. Um, even if we have got to just jump across to get into them. You know, it's not a biggie. But um, as as the game develops, I'm pretty sure we will be able to, you know, just walk from one to the other. Um, so, yeah, so there you go. That's it for the day. And I shall uh, see you all on the next episode. Please, uh, as always, leave us a like, maybe a subscribe, and a bit of advice if you can. Um, give me some sort of idea of what I could do to get from here to there. Okay, thanks ever so much for watching. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye.